the pain that those people caused you not only hurt you and affected you, but it affected the people close to you. Because the pain that these people caused you was a ripple effect. Not only were you affected, but your loved ones around you also felt the blow. Because all of this pain that these people projected onto you, you went back around your loved ones and you had to get that pain and anger off of you. And you ended up lashing out and throwing that pain out on your loved ones because all you had on you was pain. You didn't know how to, you absorbed all of their pain. You did not know how to let their energy go. You didn't know how to, they put so much on you that it was, one, you did not know how to release and cleanse your energy at the time. You did not know how to like let that energy bounce off of you. You absorbed it. And two, it was so much that you had absorbed because of so much that they put on you that you had to get that energy off of you some type of way. And the way that you would get that energy off of you is you would sometimes lash out at the people closest to you. And you were acting out of character and behaving in ways that wasn't even really aligned with you. You're like, I'm not this person. Why am I be? Why am I behaving this way? It's because of the people that you were around. It's because of the people that was bullying you and abusing you and hurting you. That's exactly why you went back to hurt your, hurt your loved ones. So the damage that they caused, they caused irreversible damage in your life and the people affected by it and the people closest to you. So knowing this, knowing how the severity of the damage and trauma that they caused you because it wasn't just you that got hit, but other people around you got hit as well. This is why you can never allow these people back into your life because they caused way too much damage. And you've been healing from this pain for years. Years, baby. And that's a shame that you have been spending years healing from something these people done put you through. And they went off and lived their life and didn't give a fuck how they treated you. But let me tell you something. All of that pain was not in vain. Because all of that pain is now turned into your power. It's, that's a part of your testimony. That's a part of your story. And while you are rising up, they are having the biggest downfall of their lives. Because these people... The first time they had access to you, that's how they treated you? Yeah, they don't deserve you. They never deserved you. They never will deserve you. You cannot allow these people back into your life because you need to see exactly how bad they fucked you up and fucked up your life, bro. You got to see what they did. And when you see it for what it is, accept it, move on, and know to never deal with them again.